question about who has contributed the most money to your campaign, two of them couldn't tell me. I couldn't or didn't want to tell you. Yeah. Uh, Pressler was the most transparent about it, named a contributor, said how much it was, which was, uh, you know, points for him, I think, in the, in the viewer's eyes. Let's talk about this, you know, and, and I know that you kind of hate it when I say <laughs> who won the debate, so let's try this. Yes. Who rose to the top, who made the most points, who made the better points? I think all three did well tonight. There were no major slip-ups, but I think in, if you're going to gauge it by points, I think Pressler got the most points, um, probably because he was the only one that spelled out his background, told us his experience, everything from growing up on a farm by Humboldt to his time in Vietnam, being a Rhodes Scholar, and his 22 years in Congress. We learned about his past. We don't know, based on that hour tonight, much about the uh, qualifications of the other two that were present. So what does it say to you that Pressler did so well, if anything? You know, I covered him in his 96 campaign where he lost, and it seems like a different Larry Pressler. There's more clarity. He seems to, he told me he's having more fun. Um, he's not handcuffed by being part of a party and so he can really talk about what he believes. And I think that we're seeing him be more independent in that sense as well. All right. Are we going to see you back here on election night with us? Well, I'll be here. All right.